three equal weights of three kilogram each are hanging on a string passing over over a frictionless pulley as shown in the figure find the tension in the string between the masses two and three so we can see the figure of this problem here so here we have three masses m1 m2 and m3 which are of equal mass that is three each of them has three kilogram each we need to find the tension between this m2 and m3 tension between these two masses here that is t2 that is we need to find so let us draw the free uh, free body diagram for each masses right so in this case of m1 the forces acting on m1 are uh, before that we need to consider acceleration of this system so acceleration of this system is downwards in the right side that is the system is moving downwards or clockwise in the right uh, it's moving clockwise so in the right side this system is moving downwards and in the left side m1 is moving upwards so here the t1 the tension one on this string in the side of m1 is t1 minus m1 g that is the equation of motion for the left hand side is t1 minus m m1 g or m g is equal to m a since the masses are equal so we just just put m so t1 minus m g is equal to m a that is the equation of motion for left hand side so for the second mass it we can write since it has uh, two masses in the right hand side so when we are talking about this t1 in the right hand side we can write the equation of motion as 2 mg is acting downwards minus the tension one is acting opposite to the motion of the system so 2 mg minus t1 is equal to 2 ma since we have two masses here so we are considering these two masses so we have 2 ma on the right hand side so that let us write it as equation 2 now we need to find the free body diagram and equation of motion for m3 so in case of m3 m3 is moving downwards so we have mg mg and the tension t2 between m3 and m2 t2 is acting opposite to the motion of the system so mg minus t2 is equal to ma that is our third equation now we can write t2 as t2 is equal to mg minus ma So T2 is Mg minus Ma. Let us write this equation as equation number 4. If we add equation 1 and 2, let us add equation 1 plus 2. What we will get is 1 plus 2 is Mg is equal to 3 m a right or m a is equal to m g divided by 3 that is our fifth equation now let us erase our first and second equations let's Hmm. 
so now we have mg is equal to sorry ma is equal to mg divided by 3 so when we substitute this value for ma in equation 4 let us substitute this ma is equal to mg by 3 in equation 4 then we will get t2 is equal to mg minus ma is mg by 3 so mg by 3 that is equal to 2 by 3 mg so t2 that is the tension between the masses 3 and 2 2 and 3 is 2 by 3 mg we know that the mass m is 3 kilogram so 2 by 3 times 3 into let's take g as 10 so the tension between the masses 2 and 3 are 20 newtons so that is the value that we are looking for so the tension between the masses m2 and m3 is 20 newton so we have done our problem